Hello, good morning. How are you all? I am fine. Last week, we learned the tenses. Now we are going to learn small sentences. Now day by day, I will make the use of Marathi less. And wherever there is necessary in the beginning, I will use little bit. But in due course, I will minimize the use of Marathi. So first, we are learning singular, plural. Singular means one, plural means many. And persons we have learnt, first person I, that is singular, plural is we. Second person is singular you, plural is also you. Whenever you are alone also you, when hundreds, thousands of you also, we use you. Third person, singular is he, she, it, plural is they. This is clear, am I right? Aplela hai sakla na karle na, singular manje ek vachan, plural manje an ek vachan. First person manje pratham purush, singular I, plural V. Second person U, plural also U. Ithe lakshat hai vaitza marathi te, tu, tumhi, apan, kete tari vagvagale shabd vapar to, English madhe fakta U, singular also, plural also. तेवढे लक्षात ठेवा इंग्लिश खूप सोपी लँग्वेज आहे व्हेरी इजी लँग्वेज इट इज आणि थर्ड पर्सन सिंगुलर ही शी इट प्लुरल इज दे इज इट क्लिअर ओके नाव वी विल गो थ्रू सम स्मॉल सेंटेन्सेस आय एम ए बॉय वॉट विल द प्लुरल वी आर बॉईज Boy is singular, you are knowing. Boys are plural. So, I am a boy. We are boys. You are a girl. What will be the plural? You are girls. He is a student. They are students. See here. He is a student. They are students now even sentences you are knowing the tense tells you much of the meaning for example i will tell you one sentence for example i get up early in the morning another sentence i got up early in the morning what is the difference there is difference in meaning i get up early in the morning means I daily get up early in the morning. That is my habit. I got up early in the morning means today I got up early in the morning. Daily I am not getting up early in the morning. But today I got up early in the morning. So you should learn the tenses because when the tense changes, Meaning also changes sometimes. I am a teacher. What will be the plural? We are teachers. You are a teacher. You are teachers. He is a boy. They are boys. She is a girl. They are girls. It is a dog. They are dogs. It you are knowing for the dog we are using the word it. Even for the child you can use it. You can use he or she. It means neutral. It is only a baby. You don't know whether it is a boy or a girl. Ranu is a teacher. They are teachers. Raju is a student. They are students. In the same way, some small sentences. I play cricket. He went to school. See, he went to school. In which tense it is? It is in the past tense. P 
past tense of go is went they had gone we wrote letters you came you are knowing how easy it is so in the beginning start with the small sentences and someone asked me to recommend any book but i tell you as far as speaking is concerned more than the books you should have the practice of speaking it is just like cycling or swimming now tell me by reading a book can you learn cycling by reading a book can you learn swimming no how you should learn you have to ride the bicycle or you have to get into the water then only you will be able to learn swimming in the same way to speak any language any language for that matter you should start speaking and remember one thing you might be scared because many of you you can read english you can write english but only the thing is you can't speak why because you are scared you feel if i go wrong what he will tell what she will tell forget about that remember you want to learn english that is important even if you go wrong doesn't matter remember how a child learns walking how it bo- walks in the beginning very clumsy he walks am i right but whether he is scared no that is why children learn very fast because they are not bothered what others tell in the same way you too concentrate fully on yourself i want to learn so whoever is speaking english in your house it can be your partner it can be your children it can be your friends make it a habit to speak in english with them doesn't matter if you go wrong see without any mistakes no one is uh, able to improve and remember one thing no one is perfect in this world nobody is perfect each and every one does some mistake or the other so remember that you want to learn and that is why first thing is start speaking in english if nobody is there you yourself write ten sentences what you want to tell and read it aloud and write the meaning also if no one is there to correct you near by send me in the comment box i will be there to correct you next you read a book she is a good girl it is a pen ram is a student this is a book if i tell you to make it in plural you have to make these are the books see the change this changes into these books changes into books these are books a means only one it is used for singular so in the same way write the sentences again and again make a notebook of your own write in that i am a teacher plural we are teachers you are a teacher you are teachers he is a teacher they are teachers in the past tense if you make the same i was a teacher we were teachers you were a teacher you were teachers when plural is there don't write a a stands for singular he was a teacher they were teachers in future tense i shall be a teacher we shall be teachers you will be a teacher 
you will be teachers he will be a teacher they will be teachers shall and will again remember it general rule is for first person shall second and third person will but there is one exception to the rule exception means where the rule doesn't hold good when there is determination we use will with the first person i will do this means let anything happen i will do this you shall not leave the place means you will not move from that place you shall not leave the place then we use the word shall with the second person when it is a order okay i think we will stop here today and go through again and again all these sentences frame your own sentences and practice it practice is a must acha have a good day